Good morning. I wanted to pop in for a second here and welcome everyone. A um, couple of things. I wanted to introduce myself for those of you that don't know me or that are new to the group. My name's Lenita Ellis, and a little bit about my story is I um, lost 70 pounds in 2011 2012 using hcg and then friends and family started asking for help to lose weight and so i started working with them and um kind of just went from there and now i work with people all over the world australia and canada and malaysia malta ireland all over the world and um brazil so um just kind of wanted to with everyone, let you know who I am, what I do. Um, a couple of things to discuss about the group, um, especially since we've uh, added so many new people, is the rules. You know, we do have some rules with this group, and a couple of them are, one, we don't endorse drops, homeopathic drops. And mm -hmm. the reason mm -hmm. for that is... Um, one, they just don't contain prescription strength HCG. And it, um, uh, Dr. Simeon was very, very um, explicit in his uh, book, Pounds and Inches, that the body requires 125 international units of HCG to be able to reset the hypothalamus and to be able to, you know, so which is basically resetting your, your hormones and your metabolism so that you can keep the weight off and also enough uh, you need 125 international units in your bloodstream to be able to protect your lean muscle mass while you're on a low calorie diet and so those are the reasons we don't endorse drops in this group um four or five years ago drops had prescription strength hcg in them but the fda required them to remove the hcg so now what they have is a vibration of the hcg molecule so if you look on a bottle of drops those of you that have drops it'll say times three times 12 times six something like that and basically um you know it's just particles of hcg and it's mostly all appetite suppressants. Um, amino acids are really good appetite suppressants. And so basically, um, you're taking appetite suppressants and living on an extremely low calorie diet that's not protecting your lean muscle mass and um, targeting the abnormal body fat. And, you know, people will say, well, I lost great on drops. Um, and there's, you know, of course, everyone's going to lose weight on 500 calories. But the problem is, is what are you doing to your body? while you're losing that weight and um, that's just why in this group um, I'm just a really strong um, advocate for health over weight loss and I mean weight loss is awesome and you know it changed my life losing 70 pounds and getting active but at what cost and it's not worth um, losing lean muscle mass to lose weight and when I talk about lean muscle mass you know you're thinking of your thighs or things like that but your heart is a lean muscle and um, when the body is restricted in calories and it doesn't have HCG protecting that lean muscle mass like your heart and some internal organs along with your thighs you know and such um, the body will go after anything it can to fuel it and it goes after the fat and the lean muscle mass so that's why we don't endorse drops um, there's plenty of groups out there that do my personal recommendation is if you're gonna do drops um, eat at least 1200 calories a day you can use the HCG foods but um, bump it up to 1200 calories that way it's being responsible you know and you're having a nice balance between food and fat um, the fat that's in, you know, in your body that you're losing to protect your lean muscle mass. So there's that. Um, all, uh, original protocol. In this group, we endorse the original protocol. And um, so and the reason why is because, you know, I've worked with several different protocols. I've tried several different protocols. And it just keeps going back to Dr. Simeon's original protocol from pounds and inches has been working for decades. And so if it's not broke, why fix it? And I know a lot of people will come out and, oh, well, you know, th th it was archaic and we've come so far. And that's, I'm sorry, I just, I, I've, like I said, I've worked with all the different protocols and I've just found that the original protocol, it is 
finely tuned and finely balanced. Um, you know, you're getting vegetables, carbs, carbs are not the enemy people. <laughs> you're getting, you know, vegetables, carbs, protein, and fruit, and, you know, a little bit of fat, you're going to be getting in the meats and the proteins that you're eating. And, you know, it's a nice balance for your body. Now, those of you that are carb or sugar addicts, um, I do, you know, understand that and know that, you know, maybe you can't have the grassini sick and some of them, you know, some of you don't even want the fruit. And, you know, there are, you know, I, I can work with you on a protocol for that, a low carb protocol. If you have serious carb or sugar addictions. Um, but you know, if, if you don't, and you just think you're going to lose more, if you cut out the fruit and the grassini, that's not actually the case. Um, Dr. Simeon really thought it all through and balanced it all out with whole, clean, real food. So that's why we follow the original protocol. It's the one that works flawlessly every time if you follow it correctly. So, and, um, the big thing, this is a recipe group. And so the main rule is if you post a recipe or suggestions of foods, please, please make sure that it is original protocol foods. And if you're unsure, um, message me and I can send you a link or, you know, a sheet, uh, a list. I actually have a list of original protocol foods and I can, I have it on PDF or I have it, you know, that I can put it in the group. And that way you can um, be sure that you're, you know, sharing with the original protocol. If you want to share a recipe that's not original protocol foods, then just let people know, you know, this is something I eat. I choose to go rogue and, and eat off protocol and I eat whatever. Um, but just so that new people know, because we have a lot of new people just starting the protocol and it's really confusing for people when, you know, people start throwing in things that are not on protocol. And, and I know that, you know, if you've done it in the past, you know that I will come on with an admin note and let people know that this isn't protocol. This isn't on the original pounds and inches protocol, which we follow. So, you know, and I'm sorry if, if you don't like the original protocol and you, you know, you want one of the other ones, there's lots and lots of Facebook groups out there that have all the different protocols. So, you know, I would encourage you to join some of them. I like to keep this one safe for the newbies, the HCG newbies who are just getting started. And it's always best to start with the original protocol because that way you know what your body does on the original protocol. So I'm really strict about making original protocol recipes. And that's what I'll be posting in there. And that's what I post in there. So there's that. Um, more about myself. Um, I offer prescription strength HCG with a doctor's prescription. You're not required to bring me the doctor's prescription. I actually work with a doctor who will go over a medical questionnaire that you fill out and he writes the prescription. He's a telemedicine doctor and he will um, go over your medical questionnaire. If he has any questions, he may call you. If not, he will issue the prescription and send the HCG. It comes from um, a compounding pharmacy here in the United States. I do also have offshore HCG and I can, I'll go over more about that later, but on a different, um, live, but right now, um, I have HCG and bacterial static water comes with a kit with everything you need for mixing, um, and your prescription from the doctor. And I also offer coaching. So, like I said, I've been doing this pretty much since 2013 and I coach women and, you know, Mainly the people I work with um, are women who have 50 to 100 pounds to lose are on, you know, diabetes medication, um, high blood pressure medication. Basically, your doctor has told you that you really need to get the weight off. And um, those are the people that, that I work with so that you can get healthy and active and enjoy your life again. You know, quit hiding from the camera. Um, can open up, put mirrors back in your house so that you can appreciate how you look and feel, um, once again in life and not be, um, shamed by your weight. And so if you, um, if that's you and you have, you know, if you've been hiding from the camera or avoiding social, um, gatherings because you're actually ashamed or embarrassed about what you weigh or how you feel about what you weigh, then, um, you can email me at lanita at becoming new again.com. 
and um, we can set up a time to talk. Um, I do complimentary phone consultations, so you can um, go ahead and email me, and we can set up a time to go over the phone on the phone over what your needs are. I believe everybody's bodies are individual, and um, I believe you know I call it bio individuality, which means that you know not one thing works for everybody. So, you know, I'd love to have a phone call with you to kind of go over your specific needs. If you're high cholesterol, high blood pressure, um, high, you know, um, the diabetes, pre-diabetic, things like that, you know, let's go over that and let's put a plan together about how to get you healthy. So anyway, you can me email me, like I said, Lanita at becoming new com, And I think that's it. I'm just really, really glad to, um, you know, the, the group has really gotten large, but also very active. Oh, I forgot to mention that I, I'm going to be running the 30 day. I, I'm doing a trial this month and it seems to be actually very well received and going well. Um, a 30 day challenge starts the beginning of every month. Um, I know some of you are doing 23 days. Some of you are doing 40 days. Um, and some are going to start in the middle of the month, but it's just kind of easy. It's kind of fun to do a challenge so that people can, um, encourage one another and um you know and it's also great for accountability so if you didn't start at the beginning of the month and or you know you're not doing 30 days that's okay just jump in on the challenge post and and um let people know how much you've lost what day you're on things like that just so you've got the accountability and you can get the encouragement from the other members and feel free to jump in and share your story your journey you know your needs about you know what's going on in your life and um, it's always fun to get to know each other a little bit better. So if you have any questions, once again, you email me. And um, I'm just really excited about this brand new year and all of us getting healthy. So have a great day and I'll do another live here pretty soon. Talk to you. Talk to you later. Bye.